Okay, just going to introduce you to a few woodland plants that are out at the moment. So we're mid-April and this white plant we can look at here is a plant called Greater Stitchwort and you can see that it has got opposite pairs of leaves. Um, a white petal, so five petals, although if you look closely they do have a notch at the end. So and sometimes that's quite deep, so it almost looks like 10 petals. The stamen in the middle are yellow, and that's quite a distinctive feature. So five white petals that are cut at the end of them, yellow stamen, and um, these lovely narrow pairs of leaves that um, are quite narrow. So that's greater stitchwort. Um, behind the stitchwort is a plant called yellow archangel. And there we are, so that has yellow flowers, as the name suggests, opposite pairs of leaves, but they're, they're thicker this time, and the you can see the shape of the flower is quite distinctive. It has this lovely yellow top hood to it, um, and they go around in a little whirl. So those two are both ancient woodland indicators. We've got a lovely display of bluebells in this woodland, um, and a couple of grasses. The grasses are quite tricky, but some of them are very indicative. So this grass here is quite distinctive. This is called wood millet, millet, sorry, wood millet. And wood millet is another ancient woodland indicator. You can see that the grass flowering heads um, are quite um, fine. And it's quite a tall grass, you can see there. And there's some bluebells, but I'll show you a little bit closer up of bluebells in a moment. And there is another grass that's again another ancient woodland indicator. This is called wood melic. And I don't know if you can see that. So they've got little brownish gra um, flowers on the end of them there. Um, and so again, that's, that's a slightly smaller grass than wood millet, but it's um, another ancient woodland indicator again topped over by bluebells and these are our lovely English bluebells they're all drooping to one side you can see that the bottom of the petals are curved back and if I was to get in there and have a sniff it would have a lovely fragrance and so this woodland with all of the English bluebells in flower at the moment is giving off a wonderful aroma okay um, 